Look at somebody and say, I am unstoppable. Whatever you thought you lost, whatever is taken from you, God will compensate you. All things work together for good to those who are called according to his what? Purpose. All things. May your life attract people that have something to do with your destiny. Neshila alakatule peri duduzu galaba ehe kusuta ene karabadaba. Ladies and gentlemen, they may have succeeded in taking the position. But the spirit in you is a restless spirit that will not keep quiet. Somebody say, I will not keep quiet. Hey, wherever you are, if you receive it and release on you the anointing of unstoppability. Zara spirit. What is Zara spirit? It's the spirit that shows up to outshine you from the back. That's the Zara spirit. You are working on some things. You are doing some. This spirit comes from the back. Notice me spirit. Presents itself. Sometimes present what you have done as though it is their own. That's the spirit I'm talking about. To outshine you from the back. It is the spirit that envies your position. And manipulate to take it. It's the spirit that contend with you in your home. And manipulate to take your husband or to take your wife. By making you to see all kinds of faults. And you think there is something better somewhere. It is the Zara spirit. Am I communicating here? I've once told you here. 70% of people who divorced or separated regretted that they divorced. A great man told me that second chance is not the best. This thing that is doing you, you want to leave, you want to, I want to break it, I'm tired, I can't continue. It is the Zara spirit that is troubling you, it is torturing you now. Very soon your eye will clear. It's the Zara spirit, it's contending with your position to force you out so that it will take over. Zara spirit. Zara spirit. When you are getting married, you think you are getting married to an angel. You are not getting married to an angel. You are getting married to a human being who is subject to all kinds of fault. Who is subject? That's what Jesus said, except by fornication's sake. But Jesus said, forgive. Can I hear somebody say, forgive? And so why will you break? Simply because your husband committed adultery and your wife committed adultery. Bishop, are you supporting adultery? No. But I'm saying to you, say, if you cannot forgive, did he not say to you that the, your wife should commit sin 490 times in a day? After that, you are free to let her go. Because your, your wife is a part of the kingdom. Your husband is a part of the kingdom. Did he commit this sin 490 times in a day? Now, if it's not possible, then forgive. Can I hear somebody say forgive? forgive. Arm robbers have wives. Arm robbers have wives. There are men whose wives prostitute to bring money for them to pay house rent. And they cover it. Evil. I know it's evil. And I'm not supporting it. But your own. Just one little thing that happened. We must break. We must scatter. Friend, Zara spirit, they trouble you. Trouble you. Somebody say, I hear. But manage what you have. Oh. There is nothing out there. Manage what you have. Nothing out there. Nothing. Somebody say, I hear. Zara spirit is the spirit, is the evil hand that attempts to pull you back from your position. 
the evil hand that attempts to pull you back from that exalted position, from that company where you are, from that office where they have given you a position. There is a Zara spirit that envies you to pull you down. Somebody is encouraging you that I, me, I know that very soon I will resign. And you too, you now went to put your resignation letter. The person said we will resign. Not knowing you, so envying your position. It's Zara's spirit. It's Zara's spirit. It has scattered the church. There are some of you that are in the church today. Somebody was encouraging you to leave. But you decided not to follow. But some have left. And those who encourage them to leave church are still in church. Is Zara's spirit. They are still in church. In fact, they occupy the position you, will, you once occupied. They force you out. It is a high-level manipulation of charismatic witchcraft. It is. Working, manipulating, even among siblings, there is this conspiracy by Zara making some one, some, some, some siblings to gang up together against one. And the same people that are working to gang up against one go back to talk to the one they are ganging up as is the other one that is saying it. It is so common. By the, by the time you now develop hatred on this and not knowing that the one that is giving you information is the one that is tearing up the controversy. It is the spirit of Zara. The spirit of who? Zara. My time is over. Elikuru <laughs> Kuruta. Let me stop here by saying to you, I will continue from here next Sunday. It is the spirit that takes the credit you deserve. Like Heman. The credit you deserve. Mordecai labored. Mordecai worked. Mordecai did all he could, unveiled the secret of the plan to slay the king. But the spirit of Haman, the spirit of Zara, works to overthrow, to take the reward. To take what? The reward that belonged to Mordecai. That ended Mordecai at the gate. And many people are standing at the gate and do not know why they are standing at the gate. The gate of wealth, the gate of success. They wonder why, with all I have done, not knowing that somebody took what belonged to you. The spirit of Zara, the spirit of Haman, planning, strategizing to take your reward. That's how you see friend. We take a friend and say, this is my, 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 my fiancé. Before you know it, fiancé changes his mind. Go marry friend. Yeah. It's the spirit of Zara that is working. That will introduce you and say, this is the kind of business. Only for that person to go back behind and take over what you have labored for. Business you have built over the years. Relationship you have built. Goodwill you have built. The person go through the back and say, it's not really like that. In fact, I will give you, um, I will give you more percentage. And, and you introduce the person, no? but do you know that many of us have suffered in the hand of this wicked spirit? Mordecai stayed at the gate and Haman was riding on horses and riding as the prime minister of Shushan the palace. And that was not just enough. Haman now planned to eliminate. Do you know why people eliminate other people? They eliminate because they don't want you to know the secrets. Yeah, people go that way to kill when they don't want to. Because if the secret is known, then people will know that you are evil. So people go ahead, poison their friends. People go ahead, do all kinds of things. When a man you call friend turns around and be sleeping with your wife, he will plan to eliminate you because the day it will be exposed, it will be evil. That's the spirit of Zara. So Haman planned to eliminate Mordecai. And can I hear somebody shout, backfire! 
Stand to your feet. My time is gone. Every hidden destiny helper be made visible in the name of Jesus. I've come to announce to somebody that the season of celebration has just started. May your life attract people that have something to do with your destiny. This week, this week is your week of testimony. Unlimited testimony. Somebody shout and receive it. I do not know who is doing this to you. Who is? This thing began in the womb. He brought forth his hand and took the position. If not that Pharaoh's fought, if not that the Pharaoh's fought, he would have been second. You remember Jacob and Esau? That is, Jacob held Esau by the heel and didn't stop there. Esau missed it for muzzle of porridge. So Jacob still fought while he came out to take the position and succeeded in taking it. He said, where was God? God was there. Listen, ladies and gentlemen, God is not going to fight the spirit of Zara for you. You will be the one to fight. God is not going to fight to take the hand that is blocking your passage. If you don't remove the hand, you will suffocate. Friend, there is a lot of shortcuts. Somebody says shortcut. But there is a due process. You know, due process don't just follow the shortcut. Shortcut, the spirit of shortcut are the spirits that don't want a long process. The spirit of make wealth quick. The spirit that says, faster, faster, your mates are living, faster. Hey, listen, the Bible said there are, there are wealth that comes so quickly, but you grow wings and fly away. I, I don't have any regret of telling you that Yahweh who is not wealth that will last. It will grow wings. Any wealth that came through the window will also fly through the window. But he said, he that getteth wealth by labor shall stand. Somebody say, I hear. It's the spirit of shortcut. Somebody say, shortcut. Shortcut will cut you short. It has cut many people short, cut many young people short, shortcut. If you don't sleep with me, it means you don't love me. It's shortcut. And you sleep. You've been keeping yourself. Just only once. Pregnancy came. The guy said, I'm not ready for pregnancy. Who suffers? In the process of aborting, you perforate your womb. Your, your day is made. Some have lost their womb and became, become man instead of woman. You don't know why they are not getting married. They are men. They are not women any, any longer. Because there was glory on them and the spirit fought it. Are you ready to pray? Say in the name of Jesus. As I pray this morning, I command thou spirit of Zara around me. Hey, hold on. Are you aware that the spirit of Zara is not in a foreign country? It's around you. If you like, pray. If you don't like, just keep your mouth shut. But I'm telling you something is around. The thing is working already. Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. As I pray right now. As I pray right now. I confront. I confront. The spirit. The spirit. Of Zara. Of Zara. By the spirit. By the spirit. Of unstoppability. Of unstoppability. You can't stop me. You can't stop me. As I pray. As I pray. As I clap my hands. As I clap my hands. You Zara spirit. You Zara spirit. I destroy. I destroy. Your power. Your power. 
Somebody clap your hands. He was shut out. They closed the gate. Zara put his hand so that Pharaohs will not come out. Haman shut the gate. Mordecai's little girl, he encouraged to become a queen, was in the palace. But he was not remembered. He sat at the gate. As a get man, his position was taken. You are going to pray with anger. I'm not just speaking, I'm prophesying. Somebody here listening to me, your position has been taken. Somebody sitting in your place and you are folding hands. And God said, You are unstoppable. Why should you fold hands? Why should you stop? Fight! Somebody said, Fight! Say in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. By the anointing of the Holy Ghost. By the anointing of the Holy Ghost. By the spirit of unstoppability. By the spirit that of is walking in me. That is walking in I me. Confront I confront every Haman. Every Zara spirit. That has closed the gate. Hear my voice. Hear my voice. I break the gate. I break the gate. As I pray. As I clap my hands. I break the Stretch your hand towards me. Jesus. If you say amen, wherever they have taken what belongs to you, Jesus. To give to another, ah. I reverse it. Amen. Yes, Lord. What belongs to you might not be only money. Ah. Might not be only cow or house. It can be your health that they have taken. Whoever, whatever has been placed in a place to manipulate, to take your position. Whatever is going on now, which you do not know, and everything is aimed. And pulling you down. Ah. If you shout amen, I crush it on this altar. Amen. I return your health back I to you. I return your wealth back to you. Amen. 
I return your success back to you. Amen. I return your breakthrough back to you. Amen. Whoever represents Zara, whoever represents Hema, whoever is planning to shine you, whoever is planning to take, manipulate, whoever is constructing it, if you shout Amen, yes, I destroy their plans. Amen. Jesus. As Fares broke through and clinched to his first position, I see you breaking forth. Amen. If your name is louder than your neighbor, then you are the one I'm prophesying. Amen. Yes, Lord. I see you taking over the positions that are too from Amen. you. It shall come to pass. Yes, Lord. They shall say to you, ah. How did you break forth? Oh, <laughs> hey. They shall say to you, ah, How manage? Ah, we didn't expect anybody ah, no, from no. your mother's womb to be like this. Hey. Nobody in your village. In fact, we have given the position to another. Jesus. They shall say to you, how manage I prophesy to you I receive in the camp of your enemy you shall spring a pleasant surprise Amen. God bless you Jesus